vicious rattlesnake. When did they start allowing rattlesnakes in the Hall of Fame, Paul? I'm looking at the toughest SOB in WWE history. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Amazing return to the ring at WrestleMania against Kevin Owens. Cole, how can we forget about multiple occasions where Byron Saxton received a stunner? Oh, guys, do you have to remind me of that again? That stunner hurt. It was the greatest moment of my professional career. I agree. And his opponent from Orlando, Florida, weighing in at 219 pounds, and man, Scott Lane. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. You can't want to test the Rattlesnake's venom. That'll basically be a death sentence for your tenure in this match. There have only been a handful of Iron Man matches in the WWE since the first one at WrestleMania 12, but this one has the makings of being a classic on par with the original. Well, there haven't been many Iron Man matches because it takes a rare superstar to compete in them. Incredible stamina, an iron will, and the tenacity of a wildcat. I know that these superstars have been doing a lot of high-intensity training and sustained cardio. They can execute every bit of their offense no matter what point it is in the match. But nothing really prepares you for the actual Iron Man match, Corey. Oh, you're absolutely right, Cole, but you gotta try. Inverted vertical suplex. Arm ringer applied. Damn for a European arm breaker. Put in the corner now. Oh. This could be big. Going up high. High risk. Oh, drop from the top. Austin in a state of distress now. Tough spot even for the Rattlesnake. Still too early in this match. Stone Cold avoids the attack. And an inverted atomic drop. If you want to succeed in an Iron Man match, is it better to focus on short-term success or on trying to play the long game? You need to think long-term. The first fall doesn't win you any bonus points. It's the final tally at the end that really matters. Uh-oh. Gets him with the counter. Waist lock, no, no! Belly to belly! My goodness! Wrenching the arm! Driven all the way down for a European arm breaker! He's getting a little battered now. He better turn the tide. Extreme rules leave no room for error. Measured elbow drop, driven down. Rolling neck snap. He can pin his opponent right here. Gets his shoulder up before the two count. It'll take more than that to hold him down. And he's a step ahead of Austin. Defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. Oh. Oh, not to the belly. Is 
Double underhook applied. Butterfly suplex. He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. What a counter. Boom, piercing the sternum. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Stone Cold off 
Austin simply refuses to quit. And you can sense the desperation mounting as that last move couldn't finish things. The WWE Universe is on its feet. And deservedly so. These superstars are holding... Just be impossible. Back elbow completely cuts them off. One with spawn tap. Everything we've witnessed, we are still at a stalemate. Austin has put away so many opponents like this before, but from the top. Elbow drop. Good lord. Listen to this place. It's the electric. Thought he had it. You gotta be kidding me. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. DDT! One step ahead there. Arm ringer applied. Down for a European arm breaker. It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. And more hits up there can leave you dazed. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. And the ref waves this one off as time expires. Wow. All that for...